I don't want to do this. Phobias are stupid. Grow up. Who are you? I'm you before you became a pussy. You're me? Yeah, we're we. We're us. Yes, I'm you and you are me and we are us. Now listen up, you pussy. Before we saw... So, we're pussies? No, no, you are. No, but you just said that we're we, no, so that, that means for sure... No, but that was before the... Like, means if that you call me a pussy, the that implies that you're also... Just listen, just listen, listen. But I'm just saying that... Just listen, okay? That, just listen, okay, okay? Yeah, yeah, sorry. Before we saw that bat in our room, we were cool. We had the best clothes, loads of women, and a shitload of confidence. Now pick yourself up and go confront that bat. You know what? We're right, us. I will. Don't be a pussy. <sighs> oh, ladies! I was cool, man. I was really cool. Time for me to get cool again. mind what is wrong with you What about when I'm walking down the hallway, I see the bat, I say, you scared me, but my voice echoes, so I say, talk about your echo location. Boo! You don't like it? No. No. Why? It's so not funny, man. It's so lame. It's just a pun. Yeah, it's a shitty pun. Why, why did we agree to do this? Seriously. You know, I don't understand. I'm just so fucking pissed. What are you guys doing? Now. All right? <laughs> Where's your spirit? Oh, you're an asshole. Ghostwriters. How do you have your own show? Hey, Paul. John, how's it going? Pretty good. Pretty good. You should get an exorcist for that hallway. I will try. Paul, how many people a year are murdered by bats? I estimate less than one. People have died as a result of rabies. People have died because they've been bit by bats. It's very uncommon, of course, to have... But people have died because bats have bitten them. That's right. Okay. Why don't we just kill the rest of the bats? Who knows what we'll discover tomorrow by studying the animals that we study today. I'm pretty sure we know all there is to know about bats. They fly. They can't see. Ah, and... another myth, John. Bats aren't blind. What do you mean? Bats have eyes just like you and I, and they can see. No. Some bats even find their food with their vision. They don't echolocate. So bats echolocate to get around. Well, do you know what the word means? Yeah. So the bats are sending out a sound, and they're listening for the echoes that return. I told you I knew what it meant. Okay. Show me how to echolocate. <whistles> yeah, that's racist. Yeah. Sorry. Well... Family show. You can cut that out later, right? Nope. That's in. 
What do you think bats would say if they did speak English? I think they would say, we should watch the John Doerr television show. Why would they say that? Because it's funny. It's a good time. It's a piece of shit. Well, they haven't seen all the episodes yet. Paul? Yes? George Clooney, Val Kilmer, Adam West, or Michael Keaton? I'm going to have to go with Michael Keaton. You'd rather have sex with Michael Keaton? Well... Paul, I had a dream that I was raped by a giant bat. Bats usually are, you know, dominant. Yeah, it, uh, it fucked me pretty hard. Did the bat talk to you? Yeah, whispered a few things in my ear. Oh! Oh, my penis! So, Paul, you're going to help me overcome my fear of bats. Are you excited? What if I get scared and crush it? Well, I'll have to get another bat. Paul, this is a big step for me. And I can't help but think that somewhere out there, someone I know is taking a big step, too. <sighs> I should have done this a long time ago. <laughs> okay, so what are, we, what are you doing? I was going to open the cage up and let you have a look at the bat. Yeah, so, so it, it's safe. It's not going to. Okay, just we'll turn it towards you, maybe. Thank you. How's that? Okay. See, look. All right. See, it's no big deal. Okay, no. Just... You want me to get her? Uh, you can get her. Oh, okay, well, now what's that noise? Hold on, 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 hold on. What is that noise that it's making? Well, obviously, I disturbed her when I touched her, and she's making sounds Yeah, well, sounds maybe we that... should put the cage door back on. Well, how am I going to get her out? Look at her. See, look, she's friendly. Oh, my God, what is that noise? No, 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 no. How, how are you going to stop that from flying away? Well, she's like a fly. Look, she'll crawl up my shirt. Dude, are you crazy? Get... Oh, my God. Like, why is she just staying on your, on your shirt? Well, she's been through this routine before. She's a, a good bat. No, she knows that I take care of her. What's her name? Well, we don't give them names, but this one is Red 36. She's why don't a... you name them? Because when you kill them, it's a little too personal. Well, uh, we don't kill the bat. <laughs> right? No, no, we don't, we don't intentionally kill the bats. But you make it look like it was an accident. Anyways, there she is. Put her back in the cage. You want to touch her, don't you? No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's the perfect girlfriend. Oh, my God, that is the most disgusting thing I've ever seen in my life. You want to see how she eats? Okay. Sure. Let me get a mealworm. Big, fat, juicy mealworm. Okay, hold on now. You just put that right there? Yeah. Now, can she smell? Look at that. Just you snap it up. Yeah, but what if she got your finger? You would have died of rabies. No, no, I have rabies shots. So, that's... so you're immune. I have protection. Can I echolocate with her for a sec? You're a disgusting little piece of crap. You were in my bedroom, and I've hated you for so long. So today I'm going to confront my fears. If you bite me and give me rabies before I go to the hospital, I will put you in my tube sock and beat you against the wall until you're a bloody mess. Understood? I thought. Okay. How does it feel? It's exciting, isn't it? That's nice. Do you feel a rush? I can feel her little heart beating, her little bad heart. Yeah. I can't believe I've been so scared of you. It feels good to confront your fears. It's almost as exciting as your first kiss, right? You scared me, you scared me for so long but Now as I hold you, I know that I was wrong If I'd only known the fear you had inside We could have talked, baby, we could have tried Now we know we could be friends and forever I understand you And you Understand me
Well, I learned a lot today. I learned that rabies shots are really painful. But I also learned that it's okay to be afraid. I mean, if we were never afraid of anything, we'd all try and skull fuck a rhino. But I'm happy. I'm happy that one of my friends overcame his fear of heights. I'm John Doerr. Thanks for watching television. I got you this.